So my job at Sustainable Conservation is around um, impact measurement. So people don't respond to data, they respond to stories. So I consider my job is really around trying to find the story in the data um, and helping work with the team to identify how do we quantify the impact we're having and tell, turn that into a story. So sustainable conservation is always focused on solutions and everyone here is always looking for innovations and ways to find practical solutions. And it's that intersection is what really drew me to sustainable conservation of finding practical solutions that involve multiple people and the different parties that are going to be impacted. Honestly, the 90s cartoon Captain Planet that was when I started being a tree hugger. That was definitely the starting point for me. I think it just had a really strong message of why saving the planet just makes sense um, versus like putting pollution into the water, into the air. Like there's just no real benefit to that. Um, and I think that just really resonated with me as a kid. I give to sustainable conservation because I see it as like a virtuous cycle of giving and uh, impact. So I see it as keeping the funds that really make philanthropy possible um, within this space so that uh, funds that are coming in from other donors are coming and staying within sustainable conservation. What makes California unique is while everyone talks about water, California focuses on collaborating around water. And that's unique to sustainable conservation, and that's a big part of the founding principle of our organization. So I see sustainable conservation playing that key role in making sure that principle goes forward as we try to find solutions.